Hi guys, back again with another video and today's video about something new and this effect used in lots of Hollywood movies. If you want to learn this effect, stay tuned until the end of the video. Hey, what's up guys? I hope you're having a great day. Welcome back to the brand new exciting video. If you are new here, this is Livingston here for my channel. I make videos here on YouTube about filmmaking and other VFX stuff as well. If you into that stuff, consider subscribing and turn on the bell notification icon so you never miss a thing on my channel. And today's video, I'm going to teach you how to make a Hollywood scan effect inside Adobe After Effects. And this is epic effect which is being used in lots of Hollywood movies as I mentioned before. So without any further ado, let's dive into Adobe After Effects. Okay, I have my clips in the After Effects. So I'm going to trim it right over here. Hit Ctrl Shift D on your keyboard and split the layer. And then right click over here and click on Trim Comb to Walk Area. There you go. Once done, I'm going to duplicate this layer and pre-compose it something like this. And then head over to the effect and preset and I'm going to search the find edges. And double click or grab it onto the clip. Tick on the invert, change the values as per your requirement. Once done, let's find the tint effect and apply it into the clip. I'm gonna change the map white to something neon blue color. And then search the glow effect and drag it onto the clip. Once done, I'm gonna change the glow threshold, radius and glow intensity to have glowing effect something like this. Once done, let's find the curve effect and drag it over here. And let's change the curve something like that. A slide right over here. Okay, now I'm gonna grab the pen tool and draw a rectangle mask over here. Once done, scroll down the mask menu and make a mask path key animation like that. So it's gonna be like this. And then let's change the mask feather expansion like this to have more blending effect with the bottom clip. Once done, let's change the blending mode to screen. And finally duplicate this layer 3 or 4 times to have more visibility. And let's play it. There you go guys, this is how we make Hollywood scan effect inside the Adobe After Effects. This is pretty much it guys from today's video, I hope you enjoyed it and got something out of it. If you did, consider subscribing and turn on the bell notification icon. I'm gonna do tutorials here and there, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, links in the description box. I'll see you guys on next one. Stay creative, peace.